It's our second night for Love Island Season 3. Will and Cinco are the two making the most waves tonight as they both got to select women to couple up with and uh, there is nothing anybody can do about it. Whoever they want to pick, that's who they are coupled with. So that kind of made things interesting. Uh, you know, it had Will and Cinco came in so quick that really our couples just weren't solidified yet. Like I think we had a little bit going with Josh and Shannon, a little bit going with Jeremy and Trina, but then after that, nothing was really even starting to solidify. So lots of options open for Will and Cinco and they really explored things before coming to their decisions. Um, initially, I thought that Cinco was going to slide in there and try to break up Jeremy and Trina. But like once I saw Cache and Cinco sit down and actually talk, I immediately was just sitting there thinking, if he picks Trina, I'm going to be pissed because 100% he should go with Cache. They definitely had better chemistry and I definitely got just a way better vibe from both of them when they were together. So was very glad to see Cinco and Cache get coupled up at the end of our episode. So that couple leaves Christian now as a single and you know they just weren't they just weren't really bonding as a couple they weren't forming any sort of relationship and then we've kind of seen christian making a play towards olivia um every time he has a chance to kiss somebody that's who he is picking you know like when we're they're playing truth truth or dare that's who he kissed when they're doing the 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 debutante ball or whatever the challenge was today whistleblower i think it was called yeah, uh, once again, he chose Olivia. And you know when they're doing those challenges, people are, like, no matter the clue, people are just picking who they want to kiss. It's it's not about figuring out who the clue matches. It's about just kissing who you want to kiss. So uh, I don't know how they are as a couple, Christian and Olivia, but at least that leaves a door open for him. Now let's jump over to Will. Uh, Will was mostly pers pursuing Kira and Shannon. Um, once again, this is a situation where I wasn't going to be very happy if uh, it was he did pick Shannon. I was way more interested in seeing what Will and Kira could form. They felt like they immediately had chemistry. They were both super attracted to each other. And, and I was really hoping that they were gonna get coupled up and that is what happened at the end of the episode. So I'm pretty happy there. So that leaves Corey out on, a, out on his own and I really just don't think he's had much of a connection with anyone in the the villa so far uh i'm i'm starting to think that even with a new girl coming in tomorrow night that Corey is probably going to land as the odd man out Corey, probably Corey or giovanni you know we really haven't seen much from giovanni at all and uh but then again you never know when the new uh woman comes in what is going to happen so that's that's about it for tonight the big the big news is uh, Will coupling with Kira, Cinco coupling with Cache, and Will, pardon me, not Will, Corey and Christian being our new single. So I'm going to wrap things up there right now. As always, thank you for watching, and I'll probably be back again tomorrow night for another recap of Love Island. So until then, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you later.